The bathroom is a safe space. Unless your roommates attack you with their pranks. Showering always calms me down. And here comes my roommate. Hey, could you give me my toothbrush? Who would have thought that my sneaky roommate is about to prank me? Make teeth out of white polymer clay. Bake them according to the package instructions. Color the teeth with ivory acrylic paint when they cool. Coat them with polish. Attach the teeth to the back of a toothbrush. Make gums out of pink hot glue. Coat them with polish. Oh my goodness! There are someone's teeth on this brush! Ew! My relaxation vanishes into thin air! Take this monstrosity away! There's a surprise for my friend in the bathroom today! Oh gosh! What happened to the toilet? What is this pink liquid? Mix 14 ounces of cornstarch with 7 ounces of dishwashing detergent. Add 5 and a half ounces of body lotion. Thoroughly stir it. And pour in 21 ounces of slime glue. Mix the mass to get an even consistency. Add 1 ounce of borax. Make big, soft slime. Color it with pink acrylic paint. Cover a toilet with plastic wrap and place the pink slime on top. Oh my gosh! You scared me! Ew! Don't touch it! That's not hygienic! Blondie loves beautiful things. Even her soap is shaped like an elegant bottle of perfume. Add almond oil to a soap base. Color one part of it with makeup pigment. Melt it in a microwave. Spritz a perfume bottle mold with rubbing alcohol. Pour black soap base into the cap. Fill the rest of the mold with clear soap base. Spray it with rubbing alcohol to get rid of bubbles. Let it harden. Make two identical soap halves. Scrape the top layer of one half. Pour warm soap base onto it and join the halves together. Smooth out the seam with a knife. Put the soap into a gift box. Add a sticker with a logo. Washing your hands with the gentle soap is so nice. And the best part is that this adorable bottle of perfume looks beautiful on a bathroom shelf. It's obvious that a true lady lives here. Cindy is a whole different story. She loves funny things. That's why her soap looks like a giant nose. Stick a long tube into a bottle pump. Pour green liquid soap into a bottle. Put in the pump. Make a big nose out of light clay. Add a hollow and a nostril at the back. Turn over the bottle and put it in so the pump fits into the nostril. Press in hollows with an awl. Put suction cups into them. 
Color the nose with acrylic paint so it looks natural. Let the clay solidify. Move, Princess Decor! My soap is much more realistic. The nose is dripping with soap. What did you think it was? Achoo! Bless you, soap nose! Our bathroom decorations are so bland. I have a fun idea for a towel. Outline a lip shape on a sheet of foam core. Cut it out with a utility knife. Trace it on red foam paper. Leave 1 inch allowances. Cut it out. Cut the allowances into a zigzag. Wrap the foam core piece. Add highlights with white acrylic paint. Make teeth out of white foam paper. Define them with a black marker. Hot glue the teeth to the back. Cut a tongue out of a pink towel. Hot glue the seams. Fasten Velcro to the edges. And hot glue the other half of the Velcro to the back. Add a red cord to be a loop. Cover the ends on the back with foam paper. Let the tongue towel out. It's a reminder that you should smile every morning. Blondie also came up with a decoration idea. But her towel is for die-hard candy lovers. Take a brown towel. Sew a rectangular piece of beige fabric to it. Crumble gold fabric and sew it to the edge of the beige fabric. Make it look like a foil chocolate wrapper. Cut rectangles out of a dark brown towel and sew the cutout frames to the piece in rows so it looks like a bar of chocolate. Attach two strips of paper tape to light fabric. Draw a chocolate label in between. And color it with fabric paints. Write the size of the chocolate. Take off the tape. Sew gold elastic ribbon to the back as a loop. What a coincidence! There's a pink tongue on the wall. And here is some tasty soft chocolate. Where should we hang this towel? Onto the tongue, of course! Yum! It's so delicious! Why is there a sneaker in the bathroom? Simple! Just put toothbrushes into it. Wrap an old plastic cup in light clay. Shape a shoe. Let it harden. Draw parts of a sneaker to fit the cup on red foam paper. Cut them out. Add details and shoelaces with white acrylic paint. Draw the sneaker sole on strips of white foam paper using a black marker. Hot glue all the pieces to the cup. Cut elastic ribbon and attach it to be laces. Put toothbrushes into the cup. My sneaker looks great on the sink. 
It holds a toothbrush instead of a foot. Hey, check out my shoe design. Well, it's creative, but I'm not that impressed. I made something way better. Check it out. Voila! It's a flower pot with daisies for toothbrushes. Wrap a piece of masking tape around a flower pot. Coat the bottom part with pink acrylic paint. Add a gold strip. Make a white polka dot pattern using the handle of a sponge. Add gold dots in the center. Cut a styrofoam ball. Make holes in the smaller piece using the heated nozzle of a glue gun. Paint the styrofoam green. Hot glue foam paper grass to it. Make flower petals out of polymer clay. Join them together. Add a ball of yellow clay to the center. Create the texture using a toothpick. Bake it following the clay instructions. Make a few flowers. Attach the flowers to the caps of toothbrushes. Place the stand into the pot and stick in the toothbrushes. A lawn stand? Well, that's very unique. But why are there so many toothbrushes? If you don't like my idea, then we can start a tooth battle. Ha! You can't fight anyone with your daisy, but my stand is the freshest. Did you like our bathroom decoration ideas? Then let us know in the comments about how you will decorate your bathroom and prank your friends. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel and click on the bell so that you don't miss new ideas for your home on Troom Troom.